I've an awful feeling about this. You'll be hurt out there. I couldn't handle that. I'll be careful, I promise. And when I'm flush with coin and set up, I'll send for you. I will. Caroline, come away! Don't exert yourself! I can't promise I'll come, Edward. If you leave on this fool's errand, I, I cannot promise anything. Don't give up on me, Caroline! Not when I need your faith the most. Seventeen eighteen. Putting some shape to your sentiments? Just a short letter home. I reckon she's past caring anyway. Oh, you're a hard heart that should be softer. Or soft in parts that should be hard. <laughs> and how is it you're so keen for his hard parts, Mr. Rackham? <laughs> like to know my secrets, would you? Oh, aye. Give me a small hint, like. Or a large one, if you're an upright gentleman. Open your hand. Oh! Who's shooting? Might be them ships sliding into port. Jesus. That sounded suspect. I'm all over it. Oh, first, let's get this treasure. So we are obviously in Nassau, and obviously the treasure's not up here. First, we need to also visit a blacksmith. Let me see what we got here. Up there, there's only one, huh? Before we actually start, I do want to visit this blacksmith. I want to buy some stuff. And make a bigger pouch if possible. Or buy the stuff for a bigger pouch. What do I need specifically? Crafting. Killer whale and capuchin. <laughs> Hello, sir. bit of that love how I only got 3500 bucks deal time <laughs> like upon a bar. I didn't know it was that much in that case howler monkey <laughs> I should just go searching for howler monkeys. And we are pretty much broke. Let's sell some stuff. Hi, right, matey, you can have my sugar. You can't have my rum, though. Yeah, you could have the rum. Got none of that. And then... A little bit of that. Return. 
I'll fain be garnished of fitter stock. And we're good to go. My thanks. Should be 10 now, right? I'm pretty sure we have. Yep. That'll work. Don't really care too much about the Pistola. I should look into upgrading that, actually. Anyway, here we go. Starting the mission. We demand a parlay. Well, I'll be hanged. George has grown tired of our shenanigans. Who's the grim fella? That's Captain Woods Rogers. Not a man I want seeing my face. We desire a parley with the men who call themselves governors of this island. Charles Vane, Ben Hornigold, and Ed Thatch. Come forth, if you please. Hear about the King's pardon, I reckon. What the hell is Hornigold doing? <sighs> Lily living punk! What are you men up to? I am grateful for your geniality, Captain Hornigold. I assumed our reception would be a troubled one. Don't mistake my decorum for deference, Governor. I'm eager to hear what you have to say. But of uncertain mind otherwise. Very well put. And it's a fairer shake than I expected to see from any pirate. But I promise fair treatment to all who hear me out. Only wait a while longer, Governor Rogers. These rascals will show their true colors in time. Calm, Commodore Chamberlain. I have given Captain Hornigold my word that we will be equitable. Won't do you a look of good. Men like him are a blight on His Majesty's reputation and a peculiar cancer afflicting the new world. Gotcha, bitch. Is this the town square? As close to one as we've ever had. Incredible. It's no cleaner than a dog's kennel. Captain Hornigold, please call your men. Rackham, Vane, the governor's come calling. Bring Burgess and Cochrane as well. What is going on here? Can I make it? About to find out right now. Huh. Safe. Fan out, lads. And take this shanty town as if it were your own. <laughs> the king has been particularly ineffective in bringing about this change, hasn't he? And has failed at all attempts until now. Careful how you talk about his majesty, governor. You're here at his pleasure. I have my methods, Commodore, and I expect you to honor them to the letter. No, you don't Stop see it. me. What the shit? And we're out. Disperse, a lot of you. Make way for the king's emissaries. Out of the way, you bastards. Go on. Our only aim here is to treat with the masters of this community. Shit. All others are encouraged to go Fuck. on with their usual business. Go on. Move. Go. Commodore Chamberlain, please see that all merchants. Masons and carpenters are rounded up and brought to me this afternoon. We must see about repairing this fortress. We should be confiscating weapons, No idea how I want to do this. I have no wish to serve on that Nah. <laughs> no well armed. We are outnumbered by a decent margin. Slow persuasion is our best and most efficient weapon. Twaddle, governor. Every goddamn ship not to ride the king's colors. Do otherwise. <laughs> this is not a good look. Not a good look. 
I had no idea how I wanted to approach that. Aye, but the king has been particularly ineffective in bringing about this change, has he? And has failed at all attempts until now. Careful how you talk about his majesty, Governor. You're here at his pleasure. I have my methods, Commodore, and I expect you to honor them to the letter. We'll do a little bit of that this time. This looks like a much better route. Disperse, a lot of you. Make way for the king's emissaries. Out of the way, you bastards. Go on. Our only aim here is to treat with the masters of the security. Get up. What are you doing? Go about their usual business. Go on, move. Go. Commodore Chamberlain, please see that all merchants and carpenters are rounded up and brought to me this afternoon. We must be about repairing this fortress. You should be confiscating weapons, Governor. Send these pirates a clear, strong message. This is a much better route. I have no wish. To wish I took this route last time. I know well armed. We are outnumbered by a decent margin. Slow persuasion is our best and most efficient weapon. Twaddle, Governor. We should send every goddamn ship not flying the king's colors. To do otherwise protect a certain weakness in our bearing. Silence, Commodore. I am the goddamn governor here, serving at the king's pleasure, and I will make the bloody decision. Is that clear, sir? Aye, sir. Your wishes are clear as crystal. You didn't see me. Charts, Commodore. We're in position. Governor Rogers believes he can make men of these monkeys yet. I do not. Return to your post and await my orders. Now what? We still hiding. What the hell? Up oh, there we go. Infiltrate fort. Go to sleep, boys. You guys see a way into this. And a plot thickens. Come on. <clears throat> what? Wait, what was the optional? Like, kill three people hanging from a ledge? Oh, come on.
go to sleep permanently. Do a little bit of that. Oh, I see our way in, maybe. No, we don't want a rifle. Nope. We'll just use this for a one shot wait here we go this gotta be it or maybe not what happened to the gun wow My health is not looking so good. How the hell do we infiltrate this bitch? There's gotta be a way in here eventually. Oh. Hello, sir. Is that possible to get there from the treetop? No one told you to jump off, buddy. Nice. And we are in there. shall on or before the 5th of September in the year of our Lord 1718 surrender him or themselves to any one of the principal secretaries of state in Great Britain or Ireland or to any governor or deputy governor of any of our plantations beyond the sea every such pirate and pirate so surrendering him or themselves as a force says shall have our great hmm. Of and for such his or their piracy or pirate is. By him or them committed before the 5th of January next ensuing. And we do hereby strictly charge and command all our admirals, captains, and other officers. I think the best way will be to go this way. And all our governors and commanders of any fort, castle, or other places in our plantation. And all our officers what are you doing? and military to seize and take such of the pirates who shall refuse it's or not what I wanted to do. surrender themselves accordingly. Where are they at? Hello, boys. Good night, boys. Jesus Christ. There's not a lot of them. We got this. I'm just going to continue on with this route and see how it goes. Get <laughs> Goodbye.
Might as well synchro that real quick. And this would be the best way. You there? Is that my No. I didn't fail. That was no fail. You're gonna get shot, my friend. Right in your ass. You don't want to check on him. You don't want to check on him. Bam. I pray you take the prudent course, gentlemen. And accept the king's pardon as soon as your hearts allow. For until such time, all of you will be confined in Nassau. I am sorry for this. But in lieu of a public trial, this pardon is your best bet. The governor puts it far too brightly, maggots. Take this message home. Accept the king's protection forthwith. Or we will raise this town to its foundation and stretch your bloody necks. Peace, Commodore Chamberlain. We are messengers, not executioners. Not yet. Oh, thank you, sir. God save you. Look on this as a stroke of fortune, lads. We should take the king's pardon and salvage what dignity we Peace. own. I'll be hanged before I surrender to that poppy. Check your head, Vane. We had here a rare opportunity, a chance to take something base and shape it into a government made and maintained by men of vision. But in two years, we pissed it away. I won't make that mistake again. It's truth he's telling, and you whelps can't handle it. A Jew, you, you folksal headed fuddlers. See you at the gallows. You'll all be dead, men! Bastards! I need a drink. Mission completed. This one didn't go too bad. I didn't kill any guards, huh? From hanging from a ledge. Anyway, moving on. <laughs>